Okay. Raindrop. Hot top, drop top, smoking on cook in the hot box. Fucking on your bitch, yeah. Th- 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 cook in the pop in the crock pot. I know, bitch, be on. All of bitches. All of bitches. All of bitches. Hey guys, um. I just want to say before I get into this video, there are still um, a bit of errors, okay? just want to announce, okay, if you do have any concerns or issues, go, um, go to the description and go and accept my invite on Discord and we will help you, okay guys? So, hey guys, what's going guys? It's me. Uh, meet snipes. Well today guys, we've got another RGH slash JTAG tutorial and today's topic is How to set up destruction v1 cracked, okay? Um, you know, um, I'm sorry to the original maker and Yeah, so let's get into this um, I just want to say first guys, I am doing a giveaway on my channel when I hit um, 1,000 subscribers and that lucky winner will uh, receive a modded account. So get this heads up, you want to get the download link, right? There are, there are a few ways of doing this guys. You can use a plugin module. Um, I don't know if you guys know that or you could just use dash launch okay there's a few ways of doing this okay um some stealth servers have uh you know it crashes when you do it okay when i first uh, did this on my plugin launcher it uh, said that the file was an error which is you know it shouldn't be an error so yeah so first of all guys you want to go to uh, dash launch right so these are my settings right uh, but the stealth server is depending okay I was on a live emulation uh, it was alright it was it was alright for a free one loads of fatal crashes wouldn't recommend it to people that use mod tools okay because of the reason of how many fatal crashes you will get um, I would I would just get three fatal crashes just um, connecting to RGHC uh, shouldn't be like that I want to make sure guys that you want to have this okay so if you're going to use the mod loader make sure that plugin 3 is blank okay um, and if you're not obviously put the plugin in there okay but I want to make sure that you put the uh, how, how do I okay guys I'm gonna place a picture of um, my settings on screen right now So yeah, those are the plugins you set in. You want to have XDR PC if you want to use any mod tools. I would recommend RGHC because it's got an IP color, it's got a stressor, it's got an XUID spoofer. Um, you know, it's got it's got one or two um, mod tools. Okay, Modern Warfare 2, great. And it's got console tools, which you're gonna need to load up Destruction V1. But if you're if you're using Dash Launch, you won't need to do it. Um, plugin three is Destruction V1. You want to make sure that both files are on your HDD, which is your hard drive. Okay. What you want to do after you've got the settings like this, guys. Save it, right? So to save it, you want to press. X A I would just do it four times, okay? So well two times, okay. X A X A but you wanna wait a second, okay, because you might lose it. Or you could just do it by uh launch.ini and yes you wanna restart that, okay? So I will be back 
with you in a second. So guys, first of all, right, once you've downloaded the files, you've probably already downloaded them, will come with the um the destruction, right? Already set, so you don't have to do anything to it, okay? So all you have to do is just drag it to your HDD, which probably you've already done, and you'll get this file too, which you wanna um drag to your HDD as well. Um, and it will also come with a <coughs> with RGHC, okay? You want to drag that also to HDD as well, okay? And if you're using RGHC as your mod, you know, a plug-in launcher, then you, you know, you want to have XDR PC obviously and if you don't know where to get that from then you can just get it from here so you want to register first it'll take you to website and you can uh, yeah just wait a second it'll take you to the um yeah so it'll take you here you'll, you'll basically um you'll register and then it'll ask you to sign in then and then you just copy this. I'd recommend you uh, doing like a little note um, text document. So how you do that? Right click, go down to new, and go down to text document, and then just copy your I A P A I Q. Um, and yeah, and then once you've done that, you want to press login. So it log in here, okay? So it says default here. That's how you're gonna connect, okay? But you, you want to make sure that you've got your uh, RGH or JTAG as default because mine's already default because it's got the uh, orange circle with the tick so yeah um, so when you've done that you want to press connect okay it's gonna load okay it'll say loading and then if you've got your speakers on it'll say RGHC connected like RGHC that. connected. So once it does that, you want to go to console tools. It'll just say plug in name there, okay? So what you want to do is you want to go to neighborhood. You want to double click on JTAG. You want to go to uh, retail hard drive. You want to go to the um, the destruction v1 cracked uh, version. Um, let me find it. It is. Mm, I don't know what it is. But it is here, right? There it is. You want to copy this, okay? Obviously, you want to just copy the destruction v1, otherwise, you'll have uh, destruction v1.xex.xex, and you don't want that. So, you want to just select that and press uh, the backspace, or you could just um, go like that and press uh, paste. It's really up to you, really. But I've got, I've got so many dots now, so that's bad. Um, once you've done that, you want to go to this uh, three lines here with the, the big line down, I don't know what to call it, but just click on it and you'll see um, whatever, so I told you to drag this file and the bin and the uh, the destruction v onene to the HDD, so if you've done that, then you want to click HDD, you want to make sure all the files um, are dragged, otherwise this won't work because it's trying to find the file it and it's not even in there so if you've done that you want to press um you know uh, launch plugin it'll ask you to allow the access because uh, a lot of mod tools um won't let you know a lot of mod tools won't let you download for some reason this says error don't worry about that guys as long if this works guys and obviously it works so if it works then it works when you do this it might give you a notification look there we go Destruction V1 notification, okay? So guys, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna show you that it actually works. Here we go, it's gonna load. Oh, it's, uh, it will say uh, destruction. Yeah, there we go. It's loaded up with the destruction V1 pre-game. Um, <coughs> mod menu, let's try and insist on the link. Like that, so I'm just gonna set up a quick game on you guys. So we can just show you, you know, that it actually works and all that stuff. Um, so yeah, like I mentioned, guys, if you do have like literally any issues with this menu, contact me on 
um, Discord and I'll be happy to help you. Um, and yeah, so it says that I am host there. I'm going to spawn a few um, bots in and then just do um, aimbot trick shot, something like that. Not normally something I would do, but when I'm bored, I would do it. So yeah, <clears throat> I'm going to do skip to last and go to uh, backflip. Um, go like this. Um, oh, I am done the... So... Yeah, th this menu is like one of the best, like literally one of the best. So that's why I'm like glad I've got this literally working because literally I've been, you know, all my life I would have, you know, I love this menu. Like at one point, you know, I wanted to buy it, but obviously I didn't have $50 at that time. So yeah. So, oh, I'm in the wrong settings, guys. So, I'm just giving you a little um, showcase of the menu. Something not big, but, you know. See, something simple, and then you can aim a knife, uh, aim a beer, and you can run around and stuff like that. You know what I mean? You, you know, something simple to show you that it actually works. And also you've got the uh, the off host as well and the disco name actually works with your host as well and the look I'll show you a few things as well because you can go like this and if you're you know not a host or something like that well if you're like a host online and you wanted to change the map you can just go like this and press X you know so I hope you've enjoyed this video guys um please like and share this video and also don't forget to subscribe to my channel for more jigtag tutorials because i will be interested in doing more guys so yeah and shall i make a next video on how to unf unfreeze classes on modern warfare 2 because it's a pain in the bum that you you get frozen so this so the next video i will make it will be for people rgh users that have that their classes have been frozen so you don't have to ask someone else to freeze them you can freeze them and freeze them yourself no or if you're unfreezing them for someone else you know there's different things you know you need to do uh, like this video and comment just um comment as well because i might do it very very soon so yeah so I will see you in the next few guys. Peace out.